What's going on, kid? Sir, can I play a little more? If a kid made a face like that at me, he's getting a fist to the mouth. Nah, bro, I gotta fix this. Did he just ignore me? Hey guys, what's going on and welcome back to another video. I know it's been quite a minute. I haven't uploaded because I got COVID again, which sucks. I'm finally through it now and today was the last day. It's still in my system a little bit. Like I'm still feeling like my throat's a little weird, but I tested negative on two tests today. So that is very good news. Um, but I just want to play some short games that I found. I have two very short ones. So I thought I would just put them in the same video instead of making them two separate videos. The first game that we have is called You Just Died, which I think we can all relate to because we're all a little bit dead inside, right guys? No, just me? All right, whatever. All right, let's hop right in. <laughs> Jeez. All right, this is... <laughs> This game is starting off fantastic already. There's zero volume, and this menu is looking a tad bit concerning. You just died. Okay, I'm not ready. I mean, realistically, I'm not ready, but for the game's sake, we'll say okay. Okay, alright, we're, we're waking up in bed. Alright. Wow, I'm like, look at this jump, I'm kind of floating a little bit. Very nice. Um... Okay, there is a pause menu, thank god. These short games, you have no idea how concerning that is half of the time. Sometimes you'll hit escape and then the game restarts. Alright, press E to read. Don't be scared that everything looks off. You died, but it's okay. Press E to open doors. If I died and woke up and there was a note that said press E to open doors, I'd be so concerned. Where'd the door go? Alright, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. We just died. Nothing's supposed to make sense. Welcome to the afterlife. Your home is beautiful. You can rest now. What is talking? What is that? Literally looks like a five-year-old messed around in paint. We hope you had a great arrival. I'm introverted. Oh. Oh, that's why you're in the corner. Okay. <laughs> Do you like what you see? Yeah. Oh, wait. Am, am I like one of these spirits too? All right. Sup, yo. Hey, these are the cool spirits right here. They're, they're chilling. They're chilling to the side. All right, what's behind this door? Ooh, bright lights. What is going on in here? Jeez. Dad? Mom is in the broom closet. What is going on, dude? <laughs> While the death brings you back to your loved ones, you may have existed just once. What? How could you forget? What do you mean? Oh, mom's supposed to be in the broom closet. Why is it locked? Davy, I missed you so much. Who are you? You look just like everybody else. Can they put some faces on these spirits? Whoa. Dude, nah, look at this one over- Wait, wh okay, hold on. There's a lot to unpack here. I don't know what that is over there. I think I could technically hop this fence, but um, let's go to the end. Let's check out this big spirit with wings over here. Is this God? You know, I thought heaven would look a little cooler. Instead, it's very boxy. Hello. Welcome to the hotel. Um, why am I in the back rooms? They're the living viewing our world from the perspective of dreams. Dude, this is the back rooms. <laughs> what? Did I, did I really get back roomed? Oh my god. It's at this point, that's that's what I'm calling it. I'm calling it back roomed. When you get backroomed, it's when you play a game thinking that there's no intention of the backrooms involved, but you somehow end up there. It seems to be just a thing that happens now. It happened for the last game, and now it's happening for this one. <laughs> Want an autograph? Who are you? Are these like the famous spirits? Did I just walk into Spirit Hollywood? Is the backrooms Spirit Hollywood? You need at least a million rememberings to go in here. Oh, alright. I don't think I got one. 
Those VIPs are so annoying. Why should they bet? Why? Why? Why should they be better than us? There we go. She died with me. Where is she? Oh, nah. That's got it. Dude, this, wait, that's depressing. That's got to be a sad thought when you're in heaven. <laughs> Can I get a drink? I know we can't drink. I just want to continue my mortal job. Ah, okay. I see what you mean. Gotcha, bro. I don't want to go over there yet. Let's explore this hall. Employee lounge. Go away. He says they shall not see us. I want to go. What is going on? That looks like a weird form of Mickey Mouse, Homer Simpson, Spongebob. And I don't know what that is. Alright, let's go this way. Alright, this is looking less backroomsy. Balconier? Dude, this is something else. Janitor Hall? Dementia. Alright. What? Diner. Are you ready to talk to him? To who? Nobody informed me that there was a meeting. Not ready, not ready, not ready. I don't like you guys. Not ready? What do you mean I'm not ready? I think I'm ready. I'm ready to speak to you. Okay. And you just teleported me away again. Stay back, it's dangerous. Alright, I'll listen. What's going on? Where am I now? Prepare. What is this game? Mmm, monkey. Okay, good luck. Wait, what? Wait, what did- I didn't see what it said! It died! Good luck. Good luck with what? Oh my god, am I ready now? Oh, nobody's saying anything to me. Maybe it'll work this time? So you are finally ready to meet me. Don't worry, you are safe here. I know how hard your life was, Davy. But now that you are here, I have to tell you the truth. For living people, existing is easy. They have a vessel. But after we die and leave our vessel, we are just our soul. I figured that out. A soul on its own can't exist without enough given energy. The most energy in the afterlife comes from people remembering us. If no one's left to remember you, you can't hold yourself together anymore. You become a cloud of distorted energy, which will either cease to exist or evolve into something else. This is not only for people, this is also for places. Every location in the afterlife is a location that means something to someone. But if a location is not remembered, it will cease to exist. That's why I brought you here. This location is currently fading away. So now you know all that. I have a question for someone else. I will remember Davy. I will. Good. Then he will remember you too. All right. I really have no idea how to feel about that. Okay. That was a pretty depressing game with like also like a Mimi twist to it. That was that was very weird. I I don't, I don't think that was enough time for just one video. So I'm going to throw another game in there. This one's called The Playground. I don't even know if this one's scary, but I've seen like seven other horror YouTubers play it, so I figured we'll just jump in. I know it's definitely a short game. Fix broken things. All right. Okay, we got a tool over here, it looks like. You didn't fix everything. Oh, okay, so this is, so I walk into there to finish, I guess. It's quite a small park. We got one kid playing. Okay. That was very loud, I'm lowering that. Okay, we fixed the swing, nice. Um... This also looks broken, right? Because there's a piece here, but not a piece there. Hey, kid, what's going on? Can I... Hello? 
Oh, you don't look very happy. <laughs> Dude, what is this game? Oh, okay. So it looks like we come back here to keep grabbing tools and stuff, I guess. Okay, some fixing noises. Okay. All right, nice. So this is a seesaw, right? That's the name for this. This is fixed. The swing's fixed. Now what's going on? Let's see, is there anything else I could grab? Okay. All right. What's going on, kid? Sir, can I play a little more? What is up with that face, dude? If a kid made a face like that at me, he's getting a fist to the mouth. Nah, bro, I gotta fix this. Did he just ignore me? Bro. Bad ending? One of four? The police found your body the next day? The merry-go-round was never repaired? So I got... How is there even four endings in this? Alright. I'll let the kid play some more, I guess. Uh, sir, can I play a little more? Yes. Thank you. Aw. Look at how happy he got. Please don't kill me again. What? No! Don't tell me he got hurt on it. Go help the kid! No! What? What is going on? Okay. Oh my god, now I need to do this all again. Oh. Okay, I found, I found some kind of secret thing here. Okay, but it looks like nothing's there. Alright, maybe something happens after we fix the other stuff. Okay, there's something over here now. Sweets! <gasps> and now I give the kid the sweets. Repairman. Kid, here you go. Now, let, now go let me fix this. I love not being able to read. Okay, we're definitely fixing it. Oh, secret ending for a four. The kid went home happily and you fixed the merry-go-round. Now, how do I get endings two and three? I forgot he hurts himself first. Yeah, there we go. Now I go to help him. Now he teleports me. Okay. Find sweets and give them to the kid. Oh, fucking Christ, he's right behind me. Jesus, that was a jump scare I did not expect. Oh my God. Get away from me, you demon child. Oh wait, I think I see the sweets. Come on, come on, come on. Get the sweets, get the sweets. Okay, now give them to the kid. Kid, hooray, thanks a lot. You're welcome, dude. Good ending, two of four. The kid went home happily and you successfully repaired the merry-go-round. Now how do I get ending three though? Go help the kid, wait. But what if I didn't help the kid? And what if I just leave? Escape ending. <laughs> you ran away from the playground and the merry-go-round was never repaired. The kid went home. All right. Okay, guys, so that was You Just Died and The Playground. Uh, let me know what you guys thought of both games. Uh, feel free to rate both out of 10. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I know these both were very random and definitely weren't, like, the best games. I just want to give you guys a little something. Guys, I'm going to be trying to do three uploads a week on here. Make sure to come over to the Twitch streams if you haven't already. The link to Twitch is in bio. I stream four days a week, so make sure to come over there and check it out. Make sure to like the video if you did enjoy it. Liking the video helps spread it out to new viewers so that they could come to the channel and stuff, so it'd be much appreciated if you're new here don't forget to subscribe uh you can always change your mind later and thank you so so much for watching i love you guys to death and i will see you guys in the next one peace